वेलकम बैक माई यूट्यूब फैमिली आई एम योर इंस्ट्रक्टर माई नेम इज राशिद इन टू डेज एपिसोड आई एम गोइंग टू गाइड यू स्टेप बाई स्टेप ऑन हाउ टू कैलकुलेट सेल्स ऑफ लास्ट सेवन डेज एंड सेल्स ऑफ लास्ट थर्टी डेज इन पावर बी आई दिस इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर ऑल डेटा एनालिस्ट बिकॉज इट्स आर जॉब टू मोनिटर वीकली एंड मंथली सेल्स रेगुलरली इवन इफ यू आर एन एब्सल्यूट बिगनर डोंट वरी आई विल एक्सप्लेन एवरी थिंग स्लोली एंड सिंपली सो यू कैन अंडरस्टैंड लेट्स लुक एट द टेबल बिफोर वी लर्न द फॉर्म in the first column we can see how much each brand sold in last 7 days in the second column we can see the total sales for last 30 days in the third column shows the sales of december only the first column is for short term performers the second column is for long term performers and this last column is for monthly performers now i will show you step by step how to calculate the last 7 day sales and last 30 day sales but before that i will paste the sales numbers into the table after the brand name now you can see here i'm having my brand wise sales for the month of december as i have selected 2024 and month december now i'm going to visit my these myers and i will click on these three dots selecting new myer and here i'm going to type last 7 day sales is equal to this is the name of the formula then i'm going to type calculate calculate tells power bi to calculate the sales in a specific way calculate changes or modify the way of the calculation we will be applying different filters so that's why we use this formula for some modification then in calculate the first parameter i will be applying the sales because i have to calculate sales and on sales i will be applying some filter dates in period this is our dax formula and the first parameter we will be providing that is calendar under into date this is the column where all dates are sorted from beginning to end then max calendar date it finds the latest date in your table for example if your data contains the data from 1st december to 31st december so the latest date will be 31st december as per your data as you can see i have selected the year of 2024 and month is december so all dates from 1st december to 31st december will be in calendar date and the maximum date of 31st december will be under this max within parenthesis calendar date and then minus 7 day minus 7 means go back 7 days from the most recent date in our data right now the most recent date is 31st december this formula will calculate sales from 25th december to 31st december now i will copy this formula go to myer and i will select new myer and here i will paste this formula and i will replace this 7 with 30 and this minus 7 with minus 30 